Wow. Uh, man, what am I doing with my life? Hey, what's up? Guys, my name is Wen, and you're watching Disney Channel. I've always wanted to do that. Two days ago, I asked you, hey, I'm gonna edit your Instagram photos, send them to me, uh, to my email, blah, blah, blah. And I got some cool submissions. So thank you for you know taking your time out of the day to send me the photos. I appreciate that. We're gonna we're gonna just kind of hop into it. What, what a weird phrase. You can't really physically hop into anything. It's like hop into it, you know. Um, anyways, so we have six photos. I got the screen recording going. Uh, you guys might not know this, but I actually edit with the Instagram editor. That was a joke. If you aren't following my Instagram, what are you doing? Cause cause please. Please, I need engagement. I need help in my engagement. I need validation. And that's the only way I can get it. What we're gonna do is hop into Lightroom. Lightroom, that is the software of choice. And I've already selected the images that I want to edit. I have not edited them, so it's not like I know what I'm doing. Uh, I just selected the ones that I wanted to edit. I'm gonna import these bad boys. Let's go, let's go. Can't start a video without the classic. Ready? Let's go. First, the first thing I do is I always crop the image so that, oh, what, it's already perfect. Wait, no way. Also guys, if you wanna know how I get this white border around my images, you just double click on your Mac or right click if you're on Windows and you select white. And I like doing that because um, that way, so like, that way, so that when you're editing a photo and you know, you wanna make sure your highlights aren't like that white, you know, you, for exposure, so. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna apply a Tyro filter. This is where I plug, which you can find link in description. We still haven't edited the photo yet. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna apply a preset. So again, this is just showing how I would do it. So, you know, it's not, this looks already so cool. So I like going for the saturated look. So personally, I would probably use this and it's a, it's a bit, it's a bit too dark and it looks a bit too like mesh together. So I'm gonna have the clarity just a bit. But then I'm gonna go down and luminance is turned up pretty good. Um, it's a little bit, you can kind of see it's a bit purple right there. So, so I'm gonna just turn down that. Turn on the saturation for that. Uh, but the subject of course is her. I'm gonna up the exposure, drop the highlights just a bit so you can see the waterfall. I do want to see more you. Uh, you know, to be honest, I think this is sick. Maybe you don't. I kind of like this desaturated look. So for me, I think that's, that's, you know, it is a bit like, I don't know why everything looks a bit meshed together though. Um, that's pretty much what I would do is I would apply my Tyro filter. Link your bio. <laughs> that photo, that photo turned out pretty good. I really like this. This is a really cool photo. Uh, waterfalls are amazing. Next image is was submitted by my dear friend, Alina. She's a great, amazing artist, amazing painter, and amazing photographer. This is cool, I don't know where this is. I think you went on our trip recently, and so I don't know, but I don't know where this is. Uh, what I'm gonna do is I will go to crop, and I'm gonna go four by five, eight by 10. This Instagram's full like size. And crop it like that, and then let's check out my filters. So I kinda like, I kinda like this one. I like this, it's just a little bit dark. Um, right here so i'm gonna what i'm gonna do is up the exposure drop the highlights and up the shadows so i think that's kind of cool and then and then if you really wanted to you could get rid of like these people so uh let's get rid of these people so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna export the image and export it open up photoshop guys again you know everything that i'm doing this could be like the most unorthodox way of doing what it is that i'm doing but i'm just telling you this is how i do it and so you know maybe, maybe that's not maybe that's not good maybe that's not the right way so i've imported the image and what i want to do is get rid of these people in the background because you know i don't know who these people are and why they photo bombing me like look at this girl she's like oh crap i'm in the image uh what i'm gonna do is hit this bandage thing content to wear rasterize and i don't know how well this is gonna work so i'm gonna just freestyle on this one but uh, it doesn't work that well to be honest Oh, that's not bad. That is not bad, actually. You, I feel like you wouldn't be able to tell. Uh, you know, I'm gonna fix that up just a bit. I just want to see. You know, I would spend a lot more time on this, but because it's it's a time sensitive video, this is not like a very trustworthy feature, but it's a very interesting one nonetheless. 
So right off the bat, you know, you're like, oh, you don't see the people, which is kind of cool. If I were to make this better, I would probably spend more time masking out the people. What I probably would do, to be honest, is duplicate one of these and uh, skill, which I can actually try doing that. Okay, so what I'm gonna do then is just kind of like duplicate right there. And then kind of, you know, maybe, you know, you know, you know, you know, you know. What you would do to make it look like it's more uh, evolved in the picture or blend in, you could get this blur and you go around the edges, just kind of blur it in, as you see, uh, like that. There's a lot you could do with this image. First off, you would not notice that, I guarantee it. And then what, because uh, we need to do the same on the other side, I'm just gonna duplicate and then flip horizontal. How's your guys' day been going, you know? How's, how's your day? In case anyone hasn't asked, I'm asking. How's your day? I hope it's going well. So, you know, like, you honestly, I don't think, honestly, if you didn't know what the before looked like, you probably wouldn't know what it looks like now. Of course, there's things that I would definitely touch up, and those things would be, uh, you know, like this right here and all that, and, you know, this is kind of a mess. Uh, but then we have... You know, this, the shadows are a little bit off. Again, I would spend more time editing that, making it look better. But I think from from here, you would not be able to tell. I honestly don't think you'd be able to tell. Uh, unless, unless you're just, you're a legend. You're just a legend. So let's hop into the next image, people, okay? Uh, my good friend, Rafi. Rafi, homie G, what's up, what's good? I think this is Dubai, bro. I, I gotta come to Dubai ASAP. I wanna go so bad. Actually pretty dope. It's like, like a lifestyle shop. Remember, first thing I always do is crop. Okay, so you notice a shadow right here in the corner. Uh, so the first thing I'll probably do, ooh. First off, this photo already looking fire, I think, in my opinion. I think I would just drop the highlights a bit because this skin's just a bit too, too bright. And to be honest, I think that this photo is sick. Uh, we're gonna go to the bandage tool. You're gonna hit content wear. And then, I'm, oh, gotta select the image, come on, man. Gonna select the image. So I'm gonna just select that and boom, watch. Look at that, isn't that crazy? I don't understand how this works. So yeah, I think this photo is pretty sick. It's pretty clean. Uh, you can remove the shadow, so you know, who's taking the picture? You don't know, you don't know. All right, so this next image was uh, submitted by Jerry. Um, a very classic, out of the window, shield plain wing shot. It's pretty dope, pretty dope, not gonna lie. I always love those shots, I can appreciate them. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna apply one of my filters to the image. And as you can tell, it's a bit it's a bit too bright, so I'm gonna just drop down the highlights, just a, just a tad, actually a lot. And I'm gonna drop the shadows. Look at this cool, like, ah, that's such a cool, like, diffused look with the blue. I would actually probably up the shadow just a tiny bit, up the clarity, to really get the detail in the mountains, you know? Okay, so this is how I would edit this image. The only thing I don't really like about this particular angle is that there's a lot of white, and the white just kind of leads you going from the bottom right and kind of just leads you into this like curve of just continuously looking there's hardly any separation between this color and this color okay so that's that's one image let's go to the next image and oh this is so sick this is from lila 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 i think it's lila uh sorry if i pronounced it wrong this is so cool so you sent me this and you told me you told me through email that this was from your Iceland trip, and I've always wanted to go to Iceland. So, what I'm gonna do, is I'm gonna hit the four by five, uh, eight by 10, and then I'm gonna just crop it to its straight and make the road kind of center. I think, I think there's a person at the end of that. Is that a person? That's a person, that's sick. This is a really cool shot. I think what I actually might do though, is remove the people from it. I think I'd actually keep that person there. I just don't know who these people are. And they're ruining the aesthetic shot. They're probably trying to get the same shot too, to be honest. So I'm gonna just remove that. And we're gonna do it like that. And then I gotta, it's hard because I gotta get in the little nooks and crannies of things. Boom, boom. This is probably so bad, to be honest. Okay. I'd probably do this in Photoshop, but look, you would never know. That's, that's amazing. Uh, okay, so we're gonna go ahead and find the preset and this I already know kind of what this image is gonna look like. I want it to be the saturated effect. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and apply this filter. We're gonna check it out. Uh, this is not bad. Uh, this ain't bad. Uh, I just don't like this faded look, so. Hmm. Let's redo that. I kind of like this where it's like a tint of that blue. It kind of gives me that uh, Iceland vibes for sure. Okay, I kind of like this image actually. 
I'm gonna drop the highlights a little bit. And we'll up the exposure just a tiny bit. But in exchange, I'm also gonna up the clarity. And then I'm gonna go to luminance and make this about maybe 23, just so that it cleans up the pixels. Cause it's a bit, it's a bit blurry, but it's all right. Well, not blurry, but. So I think this is a beautiful image. I think this is sick. I would definitely post this. Uh, it's really cool. All right, guys, and that concludes the video. Let me know your comments. Let me know if you're surprised on how I edit or the the way I uh, you know do things. Maybe you're like, uh, this guy is like not professional at all. You're totally right. <laughs> but uh, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do to get the photo and got get the photo to look like the way you want it. If you guys like this video and if you want me to do another one, let me know because I'll do that. We did it. We filmed the video. You guys want to see my janky setup that I have going on? Um, guys, look, check out check out this janky setup. Okay, so I don't have anything to hold my light because I don't have the, uh, there's like a duplicator thing for the thing that you can get on so you can add two things. And I don't have that. I should get that, but I don't have it. So I'll, I have this like old Canon camera in replacement holding the lights. You know, you're probably wondering, why did I just turn these lights on? Well, I don't like the color that they produce. Uh, so yeah, that's, that's it. Also, check out this mirror that I put up. It's being held by two tacks. I don't know how it's still up there, to be honest. Uh, my battery's about to die, so I just want to say, if you're watching to this part of the video again, thank you so much. Uh, I'm really hungry. I haven't had food. I This is the only energy thing I'm drinking, so I'm gonna go do that after I edit this video. Uh, so guys, have a sick, sick day. In a good way, like, not, not, not like, conditionally sick, but you know, you know what I mean. Okay, okay, bye.